morning. It is so hard trying to find good lighting in this place, I swear. I've got a red wall to the right of me and then I've got a blue wall to the left of me. Right now we were up visiting Joel's parents up in the high desert, which is fun. So I have to go run some errands. He's playing golf right now. I just got some work done and gotta go run some errands to get a gift for a baby. Fun stuff. So yes, little Elsa's staring at me right now because she's like, you're gonna leave me, mommy. You're gonna leave me. I'm sorry. Look at that sad little face. Oh, you're just gonna walk away? You're gonna walk away? Aw. And then as you can see in that corner, I have a bunch of boxes from that we took out of the storage because I don't want them sitting in the storage and getting ruined in this heat. Well, right now it's cold, but it was really hot for a while there. So I took out a bunch of boxes. I'm really bummed because the moving company that moved, we had different movers, but we basically had another moving company that was moving our stuff in like a big truck and they treated the stuff like crap. So I had stuff broken, so I'm going through some things, have to hit them up because I'm like, you broke my stuff, you didn't treat it nicely, and I said fragile on it. And it, they they were just horrible. They were just horrible. So um, I'm so done with the whole moving thing. But now I'm just gonna be running some errands and I decided I'm gonna vlog. I'm gonna go ahead and vlog on this. It was really exciting yesterday. Joel and I went and had lunch with Nikki and Dan Philippi on YouTube. I'm sure all of you know who they are. But she was so sweet, like so sweet. Hang on, I got a phone call, so let me, I'll stop this and get back. All right, so back in my little corner because this is the best lighting. But yeah, we went and met with Nikki and Dan and it was really great to meet them. Dan is really loving racing and really wants to get in racing and my husband is a professional race car driver so he was able to pick his brain and then I also was able to kind of pick Nikki's brain about YouTube as well because it's so nice to talk to someone. I can do as much research as I want. Like I do so much research, you guys. I read articles. I watch so many videos on how to better your channel how to get seen more, how to just go about YouTube, but there's nothing like talking to someone who's actually successful in it and to get their point of view about everything. And it was just amazing talking with her and just kind of seeing her journey and what she did to get to where she was at now. And it's just kind of inspiring and it definitely motivated me. Like when I got home, I was like, I kind of want to vlog and I wish I was more talkative, but I'm not gonna lie. I was super nervous and I was like, I get really bad anxiety, especially it's not even that like, oh, she's a huge YouTuber, she's famous, anything like that. That has nothing to do with it because I really could care less about that. I just always get super anxiety in meeting new people. So, and I've always like really looked up to her just because of her worth ethic and how, she treats YouTube, how she treats it like a business and how she works so hard at it. There's so many girls on there that, on YouTube, that just, it comes easy and they just grow and boom, but she truly works her butt off and it shows and that's what I really, really respect. So it was really nice getting to meet them. And I even told my husband, I go, YouTube, racing aside, I go, they were just a really good, wholesome couple that I was just like, they're just a really good couple just to hang out with. I mean, you don't really find many, like, you know, she's really down, they're both really down to earth. Joel and Kadan definitely have very similarities, like in personalities, and she was just really sweet. And it was just, I don't know, it was just really good. It was really nice just to meet someone also on YouTube because when I tell people what I'm like working on and what I'm trying to do, they just kind of give me this look like, you actually make money in it, like what What are you doing? So it was really nice to kind of talk with someone that knows YouTube and the world and what it can offer and not to be looked at weirdly. <laughs> so I really enjoyed that, but now I gotta get going because I have to go over to my in-law's office, business offices and switch out cars and do all that fun stuff. So it's gonna be a very exciting day. That's all I have to say. So I will vlog on my way too. So yes. Be vlogging in public. Yes, fun stuff. All right, so I will check in with you guys in a little bit. All right, so I just got done with Hobby Lobby and the Hobby Lobby was amazing here. Like they had so much cute stuff and I'm just like, I want a house. So yeah, I had fun at Ho Hobby Lobby, got some really cute decorative like boxes and stuff to put all the clothes and poison, all that fun stuff. And I didn't even go like the usual route, like how they go, They, you know how, you know, when you do a baby, you do it all pink and 
girly well I kind of did it black and white and then I did like I'm getting like a light pink bow because they didn't have anything cute that was pink it was all like hot pink so it kind of reminded me of like broho ish so yeah I kind of went a different route with it so I'm going very like a modern trendy cutesy so it'll turn out good I'll definitely show you how, what everything looks out like when I get done like putting it all together but yeah so now I'm gonna head home excited I'm so hungry I really did not eat enough today at all I think I had a bowl no I didn't even have a bowl of cereal I had like one of these like little like bread bar thingies so I need food in my belly like bad like I need some I need some like nom 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 you know so <laughs> I'm gonna go and drive home and do that hopefully I can find my way home because I don't know this area I don't know this area at all so we're gonna go do that Peace. Okay, so the lighting officially sucks in this place, like we already discussed earlier. But this is what the box looks like. This is what I got. Oh, you got that right there. Okay, so basically I put like this little uh, fuzzy stuff up on top and then the box just looks like this. It's not really like newbornish. It doesn't even look centered right now, but you know what? Let's just go with it. So basically, if I open this up, let me open it. There's the puppy pads for Elsa. So if you open it up, then you look inside, and then I have like a bedtime, like prayer book, a canvas height thingy, and then a bunch of clothes and onesies. And then we also got the mom a perfume in there. And so this is just jam packed with clothes because, yeah. Couldn't make a queue. I should have got a bigger box, but you know what? It's getting mailed, so it has to be not too big. Otherwise, it will be too expensive. And then, what else? And then, um, Joel's mom wanted me to pick up also a couple toys for the other kids, so he's got to wrap those because I suck at wrapping. I'm really, really bad at wrapping. He had a good. Go Did you do good in class today? Yeah. Okay. What did I do? Pushed in my dishwasher. Oh. Did you golf good? Yeah. yeah, I blew up at the end, but otherwise it went good. You blew up at the end. What'd you score? Uh, 89. That's not too good. Is it? So it's okay. I got five cars. Well, I look really red in this lighting. And Elsa's here. She Go stand oh, next to the red wall. Totally forgot to. Uh, get Elsa her peas and her carrots. I never went to Target or anything. So yes, wow. In this like camera, it makes it look like your bedroom is pink. Oh yeah. The lighting. Mm -hmm. The lighting sucks here. Okay, so try to find, okay. So yes, basically doing that, we're waiting for his parents to get done because I am starving. I wanna go eat. I haven't eaten since this morning and I had one of those little bar things like I said. So I need food in this belly right now. Right now. Do it, do it now. Say that again? No. Say, do you wanna do that one more time for the camera? No. You sure? No. By the way, this is an ins insane amount it's of trophies. And these are only the winning ones. These, there's still like tons and tons more. Like, this is ridiculous. Like, there's even more all on the ground. There's more in the garage. They are everywhere. They're awesome. Don't be hate. I just say, he's supposed to put like little like strings on them to see right like, now. tell his mom which ones that he wants to so keep. wrap a string around the whole thing. Basically, the ones that he wants to display, he has to put a string around. I say he needs to pick some to throw away no. because this is just, a, I'm not taking this to my future house. I am. I'm not. This is ridiculous. Look at all those trophies. His pride and joy, I swear. So yes, I'm gonna get going because I might go and just snack on a few things. <laughs> Thank you.